Welcome to my YouTube channel, everybody. I have a couple albums for sale. I am trying to make extra money for Christmas again this year. And I'm going to go through these uh, really quick. If you are interested, you can jump right on over to my personal eBay store to pick them up. Okay, let's go with this one. And this was made with the Stamperia Pink Christmas Collection. This measures six and a half by eight and a half with a three and a half inch spine. And the cover's fairly simple there because I wanted to make sure that the Christmas tree showed. So let's open it up and take a look. Right here we have a magnetic flip. And in here I have a little tuck area with a little tag. This will flip up, and there's some places right here to put a couple photos. Down here you can put a photo, and also you can get a photo down in here. This is a fold out, and it folds out not just once, but it folds out twice. And there's a place right here to journal, place a photo, whatever you'd like, and also right here. This is a little uh, booklet that I placed down, but it also serves as a tuck area. And there's a place right here to journal. And this is just a card. You can place photos in there or journal. Back here I have a large pocket and a 4x6 picture mat. And I hear my dogs in the background. Never fails. I turn the camera on and sure as heck, they're playing. So this is a magnetic fold out. And here's a tuck area. And I have a journaling card. And I have this. And you can place your photos in here. Over here is a pocket. And I have a small little booklet. And you can place photo and journal. Back here, we have a journaling spot, but it's also a tuck, and here's another one of these booklets. You can place a photo here and journal. Back here is a large pocket, and I have a 4x6 photo mat. And you can add more uh, photo mats uh, just using black cardstock to match in and placing your photos on those, too. You wanted to add that in. This is a flip, and over here you can journal or place a photo and another pocket, and I have this folder. And you can place photos in here. We'll move on to the next page, and what we have here is a little tuck spot. You can place a photo up here, and my dogs are going crazy. I apologize. Here's another booklet. You can place a photo and journal. Here is another one, and this is a, just a little folder, and you can place your photos in there. Just all tucks right back in. Over here is a fold-out, and we have a pocket, and here is a picture mat. And here is another fold-out, and a place to journal, and places for photos. Here we have a large side pocket, as you would call, and you can get your photos in up this way or this way. And I have a journaling tag here and a photo mat to place your photos on. Over here we have a uh, fussy cut out the Christmas dress, and I just slid this little booklet in here. And you can journal, place photos, or just journal on both. Back here is a large pocket. I have a 4x6 photo mat. And then I have this. You can place a photo back here. You can journal or put a photo right in here. Back here we have a fold out. And you can place a photo here or you can journal. Alright, this folds out. And there is a place right here 
to a journal or place a photo and lots of places here for photos. This is a tag and it is glued down to make a tuck and we have another folder. And back here a large pocket with a 4x6 photo mat. Here we have a tuck area with another folder. Place your photos and you can place photos back here of course too. Here we have a magnetic flip. It flips up. We have a pocket with a couple picture mats. And we have down here, you can place a photo, and this flips down for another place for a photo. We have a large side pocket, and we have a photo mat here, and a 4x6 here. So that album here is for sale. Let's move on to the French Country one. The French Country album is an 8x8 eight eight with a 2 and 3 quarter inch spine. And I've got some bling up here, a couple flowers, and then the back. And we got some lace and some flat back pearls. This is a large magnetic fold out. And when you fold it out, we have a, a large side pocket with some pitcher mats. This folds out as well, and if you wanted to put a couple photos here, you could. And right on over here, we have a tuck area with a photo mat. Here, this is uh, just a flip out, and you can journal, place a photo, and we have an extra journaling card in here. I'll just slide that there to keep it. Back here is a pocket, and I've got some picture mats in here. All right, this one will now flip out, so it keeps going on here. Places here to put your photos, two or one pocket and two picture mats, and this little picture mat you can pull out. Over here, this is going to fold out on us, but right here we have a flip, and you can place photo in there. And then I've tucked back behind this little card and a photo mat. It just slides right back in there. This will flip up now and it will give us a nice spot for a good size photo. Down here, place for a photo and it flips down another place. So we got a lot going on here. We have a side pocket and we have a pocket here and a back pocket. So in this pocket I just put a couple of the pieces. We have a little journaling card and we have this little postage stamp and uh, just kind of slides all back into this little pocket I created. And on the side, we have a journaling card and a smaller picture mat. Back here is a large pocket, and I have a larger picture mat. We have another tag and a couple of the smaller picture mats in there. Moving on, we have a large back pocket here with some larger picture mats and a smaller one, and we have a tuck area for a smaller picture mat. Over here we have a fold out, and it will fold out again, so lots of places here for photos. And then we have a very large uh, back pocket here, and I'm going to stand these up right when I put them back in. There, now they won't disappear. Okay, coming on to this page, we have uh, this will flip out, but it's a removable folder for the side, and you'll see that in just a moment. This is magnetic, and it will open up, place to journal, place for photos here, and I have another photo map free, free floating in there. This will open up, and there's a large spot for photos, and there's also a spot here, and it will fold out another spot, and you've got this. So this was what you originally first saw, and it's a very large side pocket, and it's a folder. And I got several large picture mats in here on the side. Just all kind of does its thing. 
Over here we have a picture map and I made it so you can tuck back a little journaling card here. And I have also tucked back behind a picture mat. Down here is just a small little pocket with a little stamp journaling cards. Just all slips back in behind. Next page we have this magnetic little flips. So this will flip up and you have a spot here for a photo, spot here, and here's journaling and these will flip out as well revealing a very large pocket back here. And I got a little journaling tag in there and some 4x6 or so uh, picture mats. Over here we have a uh, magnetic uh, little folder and it also you can tuck back behind it and I have a couple picture mats there and places for photos and this will fold out again we have a pocket over here that you can pull it in off to the side or push it in from the top. Back here we have another uh, flip. We have some picture mats in there and a journaling card and you can journal right here put a picture, which is whatever it is that you would like to do. So let's flip that out and it reveals a huge page for a couple photos and we have a, another flip right here but it's also a side pocket. And you flip that out, great place for a photo here, here, and this will fold out another place for a photo, and we have this journaling tag that we can tuck our photo mats back behind. It just all sticks back in there. So this has quite a bit of flips and all that good stuff. And we just slide that right back in, and that goes over the top there. And that is the French country album that I created. It holds quite a bit of photos. Thanks for checking it out. And again, if you're interested in any of these uh, albums, they will be on my personal eBay store and a link is below the video. Now I still have a lot more to show that is for sale, so I will do that in the next video. Happy crafting!